We want to make a lot of noise and we want to make sure everybody hears we don't want war, we want peace. Uh, we want people to hear and understand how thousands and tens of thousands and millions of lives are um, being destroyed uh, day by day. And we are calling upon everyone to do as much as they can to stop the war, to put down uh, the fighting and uh, try to, way, uh, to find a way to peace. And especially as the Jewish community in Hungary, we try to do everything in order to help uh, our brothers and sisters that are arriving in the thousands from Ukraine, as, as well as just general people that are uh, fleeing Ukraine and trying to uh, find a safe shelter. For us, Ukraine, a peaceful Ukraine is extremely important. We have uh, over 300 communities in Ukraine, uh, 300,000 Jews in Ukraine, and we all pray for uh, a peace in Ukraine. And my message is that we should never forget that even if we cannot fight physically, sometimes the spiritual fight is even stronger. Not to give up, not to let our spirits down, to always hope for the better. We didn't want to leave. In, uh, even our rabbi used to say that we're supposed to stay and everything will finish very fast because uh, it couldn't be so hard. Nobody believed. So we stayed there three days and uh, on Saturday on Shabbat by himself he came to us and told us to leave the city, Kiev. <laughs> we believe that uh, uh, God will help that uh, everything will, will finish in a good way.